Not what I intended, but it worked. Nice. Humanity. Wait, what? Where's that? Oh, there it is. It's like, where'd the hole go? I'm guessing it leads to where I'm about to go anyway, but I prefer not to just drop down on a bunch of enemies. That can cause problems. I'm guessing those are supposed to be like the corpses of people these things have killed, like all Medusa style. I'm guessing. Got shield up. Looking on the ceiling. Okay, that's where we just went up up top. This will probably been to the right. Yep, there's the hole that I would have dropped down. I don't see any gooey things. Ring of the Evil Eye. Oh, this is a nice ring if I remember right. Uh, blue Tear Stone. Let's see. Ring of the Evil Eye. Absorb HP from falling enemies. According to legend, this ring contains the spirit of the Evil Eye, a dark beast which assaulted Astora. The strength of the eye does not waver, and HP is absorbed from falling enemies. I'll use that over in the Blue Tear Stone. I like getting health back on kills. I've always liked uh, uh, hit point stealing type weapons and abilities and spells like life taps. I've always liked those. Wait. This. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I have freed you from your curse, sort of. Even though you don't turn to stone when you get cursed, but you're a special. Okay, so where are we going? I need to find how to get to the boss at this point. <laughs> Damn rat thing. Um, unless there's a door or something I'm missing. Was a dead end, right? Yep. I'll run down this way and see if there's anything I missed. Oh, you know what? Uh, let's. I want to find that pathway up to where the giant rat is and slide all the way down. I think that might take us to the boss. Even though. Man, I really need to hit it. I don't want to fight the boss with two Estus Flask, to be honest. I might do it anyway just to see if that is the right path. Homeward bone back and then go that way again. It seemed like there was an easy way to get to him, but I'm totally spacing on right now. Because I did have to run there several times. In fact, this looks like it. But I don't know how I got here. God damn it. Okay, can't go that way. Okay. I gotta say, what's the point of this? Put her shield up. Uh, what's over here? Whoa. Ching! Ching! Oh, there's an echo. Nice, nice effect. That's actually pretty neat. I like that. Is there a hidden wall around here somewhere? Or a hidden thing? I think rolling into a visible wall will also reveal it. I think. Not just smacking it with your sword. Yep. Yep. I think this goes to the boss. Maybe. Over here first. Mm, nothing of interest. Yeah, I'm feeling like that goes that way, but I want to see again if there's a way to get back to a campfire. This is different, I'm pretty sure. Pretty damn sure. I might go ahead and try him with two 
I really wish if I had remembered the Kindle, this wouldn't have happened. I wouldn't have got invaded. Damn it. Uh, man. How many humanity? I've got seven humanity. Fuck it. Let's do this like a boss. We're probably going to die like a boss, but... I'll drink during the cinematic. See, that kind of looks like a sword. Get off of that. My desire to use a pine resin is pretty high. Let's see how much damage I do. You can also get the tail of this guy as well. don't really remember his or her attacks. Uh, the charge is my favorite, because it doesn't really do much. Damn, I'm surprised the tail hasn't come off yet. To be honest. God, come on. Why do I keep saying it, to be honest? There we go. That makes me feel much better about this fight, because you don't know how many times I lost this fight because of the tail lash, because it hurts like a bastard. Damn it. All right, let's not get greedy. Don't get greedy. But yeah, I feel so much better with the tail being gone. Let's not get cocky though. Shit, God damn it. The other problem with this boss is you can't lock in with the shit. Now, if you hit the head, though, it does a lot of damage. But again, not worth it. I'd rather just watch him do this. Charge into a random wall. Okay, run. Okay, again, sorry if I'm quiet. I'm just trying to focus. I'd rather do this as a one-shot thing. I could actually run up and probably hit the head once before she starts charging. Uh, you do have to watch the feet, though. The feet do hurt. Even while she's standing still. Okay, do not get stuck there like an idiot. Shit. I, like, turned around and she was gone. I was like, uh-oh. Oh, and she's throwing up, which is really, really gross. This looks like a combination of throw up and shit, which makes it worse. I was trying to get to the back so I could hit that, <laughs> so I could hit the back. I'll cut the tail off again. Run, 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 run. Get away. Again, don't risk it. It's not worth it. See, with the tail gone, I can be much more blasé about running away. And I want to hit the head so bad. What the hell? Did I, what did I get souls for? Or did I get souls just now? Wow, man, that kills even my video card. Run. Yeah, good, good kick there. Oh shit. I can't see you. Oh, I want to hit that head so bad. You don't know. Use heavy attacks. 
I don't know if it's really worth it. But I did what? 488 that time? Let's watch. Not the most uh, graceful boss of all time. Think she's gonna puke. Nope. I almost got myself stuck in the corner with the moron. Nope. Much more damage doing the weak attacks. Doesn't seem like strong... Well, I guess strong attacks is okay if it's, like, right on the thing. Why would she think... Somebody... A friend of mine messaged me. He's like, are you on a date again? It's like, if I was on a date, why would I be playing Dark Souls? She says that, like, I get dates all the time. Uh, I don't, by the way. Come on... You know what? No. No, no, no. Don't be stupid. Don't be fucking stupid. You got it. Don't blow it by being a goddamn greedy moron. You know, just out of curiosity, though. I want to try the spear. I want to see how much damage the spear's doing. Not bad. Nice, man. See, you get rid of that tail, that dragon is so much easier. Oh god, no. Blight Town Key. Ugh. You have no idea how much I'm not looking forward to that. Okay. So, I uh, saw this guy had some loot over here. Standard helm, hard leather, hard leather. I kind of want to see what that looks like. It's probably worse than what I'm wearing, but I'll be, I'll be lighter. I should be able to run and roll faster. I'm totally wearing that sack. It was hard. Excuse me, it was hard leather, right? Uh, it's got better defense and whatnot. Wait, it weighs more than what I'm wearing now? Oh, I was. That's right. I was the other thing. Leather boots. <laughs> That seems worse. Doesn't it? It looks like shit, too. Hard leather. I like the black leather. Let's switch to that for a while. Eh. I think it's about the same roll rate. I love my sack, though. I actually got the sack last time, too. All right, let's look around. So, we will... Oh, shit. Yeah, let's run right off the edge of that. I didn't know there was a drop off over here. So, yeah, that is the first time I've killed that boss. Uh, I probably lost, like... Probably six, seven times on my uh, first... Well, technically, second playthrough. Basically, the way it worked was the first time I started playing this, I was playing it at work on my lunch breaks. And I didn't get very far. I got to... Um, I got to, I think I beat the gargoyles. Pretty sure I did. That's just back up where we came. And then I started another profile at home because they don't have Xbox Live. Gold. So I just started a whole new character and I got to the, uh, the gaping dragon. And, uh, yeah, so... And of course, obviously, as I mentioned, the Madam or Madam Butterfly, the the butterfly was my first time as well. I guess we could just homeward bone, right? Is that really a lot of reason to run back up? I'm trying to remember. Oh shit! I almost missed this. Heavy crossbow and heavy bolt. Nice. I have to see if the heavy crossbow is better than the light crossbow. I'm thinking the light's probably faster. I mean, I would think. This was a dead end, right? Okay. So again, hopefully you guys are enjoying this. I played a pretty decent session today. I think I'm going at least two hours. Which, maybe I'm getting old. That's not a decent session. That's a small session. Because I remember having to make this run several times on my Xbox at home. But I don't remember... 
I think it was up here. I wish you could see my fingers when I'm trying to run and move the camera. Like, I have to put my, like, middle finger on the run, and then I'm using my thumb. Oh, shit, don't do that. My thumb and my index finger try to uh, move the camera. Okay, that was the dead end. Wow, 31,000 souls. I definitely do not want to die. If at all possible. Oh, that's right. I think we end up... Uh, where is that hallway that goes up to the where the ladder was and we get oh here it is here it is how did I miss that that vendor last time seriously like I had to make that run like six or seven times how did I miss him gotta be blind as hell you know what I don't even remember how to get to blight town to be honest, because I've never been. And I am not looking forward to it, because I know it is both very, very laggy and a real bastard to get through. So, I haven't died too much. I've died a pretty decent number of times, for sure. Ah, oh, there's the campfire, or bonfire, whatever. There's the slimes. Hey, dickhead. Come on over. Lol. Let's see, let's rest. Do we want to rest? I'm thinking no. Let me explain my logic. Well, no, because everything above me is alive again. Okay. Because I was going to say, well, no, because I'd have to kill everything that's on the path up again. But all that stuff, I, I died, so. Uh, it's not worth it. Uh, let's go ahead and level up. Um, uh, shit. Man, I'm really confused what I want to... Endurance is doing pretty good. I kind of want to get my dexterity up. Holy shit. Wow, that was a fuck ton of levels. Holy shit. 25 dexterity. Hopefully that's okay. Because, again, I don't want to fuck my scores up. But, again, worst case scenario, I farm off camera. How much damage does this do? 89? Let's just run past these. 115. God damn! It's disappointing because I'm putting all this points of dexterity and this sword is still significantly better. Though I guess, you know, if I start actually using backstab and shit more often, which I should be, then it'll even out since the spear gets a bigger bonus uh, from critical hits. I'm pretty sure the butcher or the chef or whatever did not spawn. Pretty sure. Kind of want to hit up Andre as well. Level up this uh, spear. Hopefully it'll start catching up. On damage, which of course you could say, well, why don't you? Well, I guess you can't upgrade the. You can't upgrade the. Uh, the dagger, I mean the dagger, Jesus. The spear. Speaking of, this works out. You can't upgrade the. I see you down there, bitch. Calm down. Lol. If I could get a bow, I'd actually have some pretty decent damage on it, I think, too. Ah, hey, you can't crawl up here. Some bullshit. Some bullshit. Hello, dog dog. Push the spear. Fuck, I don't have my spear. Fuck! <laughs> Please, I really want, like, three slots. Three weapon slots. Is that too much to ask? Probably is. Target the dog. Target the dog. God, he's not that far away. Wow. Please target him. Nope. Switch weapons. Thank you. Okay. Ah, uh, whoopsie. Use humanity. Oh, well. No biggie. 
Not too worried about it. Again, humanity you can farm if you have to. And if I do any farming, I will do it off camera because I can't possibly imagine people would be interested in watching that. 